Alright, I'm going to show you how to do a revolve now. So this is a continuation of the extrude video. First I'm going to show you a couple of things that you can do over here in the feature tree. So every time you make a change to your object, it adds that feature or change over here. So we started with this sketch, which you can see outlined. Then we did a one inch extrude of that whole area. Then I made another sketch, which was the hole on top. And then I used a remove extrude to drill that down as a hole. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to undo some of that stuff by deleting it. So I'm going to start here with the extrude 2. Notice that took that hole away. I can delete sketch 2. That took that circle off the top. And I can delete that extrude. Now I'm back to my original sketch. So this time, instead of doing an extrude, I'm going to do a revolve. And the revolve tool is right here. The way that it works is it needs two pieces of information. The first thing it needs is a face or a region that is going to be revolved. So I clicked on that and it says face of sketch one, which is the first thing I drew. Now the second thing it needs, which is prompting me here in red, is an axis. So that would be where it's going to rotate. I'm going to choose this line right here. That's me. So let me do that again. Select that. And then this face. Now I'm going to give it some time. And here's my revolved shape. Now I can hit OK here and I can take a look at this from some different angles. Just to see. It should look the same from that side. Gives it a little bit look there. And look at it from the front bottom, so on. Now let's say I wanted to revolve it around a different axis. I'm going to go back a step. I'm going to delete this revolve. I'm going to reorient this so it's back that direction. Let's say I wanted to revolve it around this. It's going to give me a very different shape. So I click revolve. I click on the shape that I want. And then I click revolve axis. And then I click that. When I'm finished, I hit that. So now zoom out here. This gives me a very different part. And look at this from different angles. Of course, if I want to undo that, I can either go undo or I could delete that revolve. There I am back to my original. 